What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another banger of a video. In this one, we are opening Korean Yu-Gi-Oh! Cybernetic Revolution Booster Box. I've been waiting for this guy to come in. I've been pumped for it. We've opened a couple of Korean Yu-Gi-Oh! Booster Boxes in the past, and this is going to add to our repertoire. Super pumped for this. The pull cards in here that you want to get are obviously, as pictured on the front, Cyber... I think that's Cyber End Dragon. This set I'm a little less familiar with, but I still think it's going to be great fun to open up. In a Korean booster box, you get 40 packs of five cards, so we are going to have our time cut out for us. The wonderful Korean man I purchased this box from also included one of these packs. I don't know what set it's from. Maybe by the time I'm editing this, I'll be able to pop it up there. Uh, but if I can't, then it's just going to be a cool little bonus. But yeah, he sent that to us, so we're going to open that too. Let's get into this wonderful, beautiful booster box. Here is what the pack art looks like. It looks the same as the box itself. Everybody knows the rules. Korean packs get the scissors. So let's get into it. I'm not, obviously I can't read uh, Korean. So we're just gonna play it by what it looks like. Uh, okay, I don't remember what that, I thought I, I thought I knew some of the names. I did a little bit of studying and we got right off the, holy shit, right off the bat, we got an ultra rare. Cyber End Dragon, I think that is. I think this is one of the biggest hits in the box, for sure. Right off the bat, that is so sick. Upon closer examination, yes, this is uh, Cyber End Dragon. It is not the ultimate rare, which is a card that's worth like hundreds and hundreds of dollars, but it's still a banger. Right off, as I was opening this, I said, what we want is a Cyber End Dragon. Uh, and that's what we got. Hopefully, I think we're due some ultimate rares or like secret rares. So let's see what we can get in there. Whoa, this woman has a torch in her hand. Cro a frog singing. You got a little girl with a bunny hat and a whip. And on the end, we got a bicycle. Just a bicycle with gloves on. Sick artwork though, I do like the art on that. Next pack, keeping it rolling. We have a lot to get through. 40 packs is gonna be a long video. My other ones have been real short lately. So let's keep it rolling. Goblins, dragon, coming through a mirror. Little battery thing. And you got a, what the hell is that? A plane? I can't even tell. Next pack, ripping and rolling. Yep, I don't know really what else we're looking for here. Just something, maybe more Cyber Run Dragons. Train here. Elemental Hero Bubble Man is also a big hit, I believe, in this one. I don't know the name of that card. This is a, dry, a dinosaur with lightning around it. This card, I was also hoping for. I saw it. It's cute. I think it's Jerry Bean Man or something like that. Cute little card. Next pack. Let's get it, y'all. The Korean booster packs are fun to open. I wish I could obviously read it. If the English sets weren't so expensive, I'd buy some of those, but they sure are expensive when they're this old. You got a toad licking a card, and on the end, you got... That's like Frieza crossed with a crab. Next in, let's keep rolling. Getting commons in a row here. Let's see if we can get anything better than that. Police car, that's buff. Dry, or Dragon girl is what I was going to call her. Pot. Tadpole. Man flexing on a paper airplane. Another one. These packs fly through here because they're only five cards. There's not much to like look at, go over. Goblin Android. Fire Girl again. Frogs are singing. Frog in lightning. Punching bike. More packs time, more packs time, more packs time. The uh, I tried to do some research this time and look at the set beforehand so I could know some of the names, but obviously that did not pay off. Little girls playing with the whip. This time, this man's eating on the paper airplane. And we got a plane on the back again. Or a train. That's a train for sure. It just had wings. So the wings were slightly throwing me off. But yeah, if you guys do like me opening up these Korean Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, definitely leave a like. Leave a comment down below. Let me know. I love opening these. Uh, and I would love to open more. So I can do more and more sets. They just keep coming. That's a little angel boy. That looks like um, the little boy from Seven Deadly Sins. I don't know his name anymore. And that is a little Jerry Bean Man on the end. We have in the past opened up, what, Legend of Blue Eyes, Spell Ruler, and Pharaoh's Servant all in Korean. And now we're adding Cybernetic Revolution to the mix. So a sweet lineup, I would say. Freezer Crab on the end in that pack. Can't really go wrong with that lineup. We did pull the Blue Eyes, so, and we got the Cyber End Dragon in this set. Maybe, I think one set we need to revisit is the Spell Ruler because we didn't get we didn't get the Toon Blue Eyes or the Toon Dark Magician. I'm just coasting through all these packs here. I do want to do more modern Yu-Gi-Oh too, but you know, Toad Singing. I think it's called Death Frog or something like that. Little Bunny Girl with the Whip, and on the end, 
This is literally an assault bike, pop up an assault bike. This is literally what it is. Not even a super rare here for a little while. So we need something to turn the tides here. I mean, right off the bat, we did get Cyber and Dragon. As I keep mentioning, I'm just a little excited about it. We got Drillroid, I learned his name. Lady with the Dragon Spear, Dragon Through the Mirror. You got Battery Man, and on the end, you got Trainroid, maybe. Cutting her up, let's get it. Cruising for a bruising. Des Frog, I think, again. Ooh, this time it's Lady with a Water Spear. Drillroid, I think that one is for sure Drillroid. Pert Warrior, and then just a regular rare, Water. Sick one. Hey, a rare is still better than nothing, and we've been on a hot streak of just garbage, so let's keep let's keep the rares a coming. Lady with a wind spear this time. Train man, frog with card. Another rare. This time it is two people flying in a typhoon around an H. The artwork for this set is pretty sick too. I feel like with Yu-Gi-Oh, I've done it a disservice by not appreciating the artwork just because it's so small. Uh, but a lot of the artwork is really cool in these cards. Playing that fights. Bunny girl with a whip. D-D-M. Hey, that one is in English. I can read that one. This guy's kind of sick with the, like, arms. I don't know, cyber arms. Kind of sick. Next pack. Here we go. Keeping it rolling. D-D-M on our coattails. Samurai with the box. Dragon. Police car boxer thing. Battery man. Another rare again. We just are hitting like a vein of rares right now. This looks like the Bubble Man card, but I thought that was like a super rare. I don't know. Maybe there's a super rare version. Elemental Hero Bubble Man. I played with Elemental Heroes a lot as a kid. I never played the game right. This is called Pot of Generosity, I figured out. Uh, but yeah, I never played the game properly. Fire Girl, we like her. Goblin zombie cyber man dragon and on the end we got another rare dragon with a sick ass orb on his back cyber dragon type deal but not actual cyber dragon maybe these korean boxes can be like mapped out and so that's why i'm hitting a vein of rares because i did not mix them up this time Des frogs goblins uh businessman robot frog licking a card and cyber dog type beat. This one's kind of sick. A little Tron dog. We'll take that. But yeah, maybe you can map these out because I did not mix it up and we've hit like 10 rares in a row. Uh, so for future reference, mix up your Korean Yu-Gi-Oh boxes. Dragon in the mirror. King striking down like a knight. Summon skull but cyber. Toad. And you got a big ass column of cyber energy shocking boys in the background. Sick. I really wanted to open up some Yu-Gi-Oh cards because I've been watching so many of Team APS's videos lately. If you guys haven't seen them, go check them out. They just duel and play Yu-Gi-Oh all the time and it is sick. I love those videos. Frog with lightning. You got another two boys mixed in the tornado here. All right, we have 18 packs remaining of our Korean Yu-Gi-Oh box here. So now I am, sorry for the noise, now I am officially mixing them up uh, just in case we potentially could get a secret rare sooner or we stop just hitting thousands of rare cards in a row. I wanted to open up this pack at exactly halfway, so let's get that going. I don't know what set this is again. It will be in the video. I don't know as of time of recording. You got a little, I don't even know how to describe that, slug in the water. Man holding a spear. This looks like the bad guy from One Piece in the first season. Um, triangle thing. Man about to get absolutely smoked. And on the end, we got, ooh, super rare, Sphinx lizard snake type beat. This thing is kind of sick. Uh, a little rare, but I'll have to look up what that set is means there uh but this is a cool little extra card thank you for the extra pack random korean man let's keep it rolling we have one ultra rare so far i believe we're due at least two and one of them could possibly be a secret so let's hope we get a secret we got pot of generosity we got fire lady we got robot goblin we got dragon covered in lightning we got man feeling the absolute burn he's about to go super show sick Let's keep it rolling. We have 18 packs left before I open those two. So now we have 16. Samurai Lady. We got Dragon Spear Person. Uh, Soitsu or Toitsu or something. I tried to look it up in between. DDM again, my boy. We just keep popping out these rares like hotcakes, my guy. 
I like them when they're in English, but unfortunately, booster boxes for these are Cuckoo Bananas because they're vintage. You got Cyberoid, Flyroid, I don't know. Um, Dragon Spear, Pot of Generosity, Poison Draw Frog, I think. Yeah, Poison Draw Frog, I looked it up. Elemental Hero Bubble Man, Secret Rare. Oh, or Ultimate Rare. That is sick. Look at, can you see the pattern? Wow, that is sick. This is either Ultra or Ultimate Rare. I don't know how to tell the difference. I'm assuming that it's the pattern because this is an Ultra and there's no pattern. This is sick, man. Damn, brother, we got the Elemental Hero Bubble Man in the, I hope that's an Ultimate Rare. I don't want to sound like an idiot, but that looks ultimately rare in my eyes. So let's keep it rolling. I don't know. I think that those would count as our two Ultra Rares, but let's see. There's still some hope out there. F flame stick lady pot of whatever tyranno infinity i think and jerry bean man my favorite common card we're gonna keep the video rolling we are now about to do a mega pack so brace all of yourselves we're gonna open one pack set the cards down you can kind of see them so it works out we're gonna open a second pack with the scissors set that pack down we are gonna open a third pack with the scissors set that pack down and go through them all at once normally i'd separate the rare but i don't feel like it right this second fusion thing arrival appears plane roid uh ebon magician koran or something similar to that rare card man hitting a woman samurai time dragon windspear lady patroid battery man c i know his name now i was close with just battery man Little Imp Goblin, he looks like Garlic Jr. Rare. Fire Stick Lady. Battery Man C. Sat Taitsu. Summon Skull, but electric. And you got a super rare Cyber and Dragon, I believe. Or Cyber Twin Dragon. That's a sick looking super rare. Take that all day, baby. Okay, after the Mega Stack, we got the Twin Dragon, which is sick. What do we got in this Fire Jamma? We got Cyber Goblin. King with the Knight, Fusion something. This is Death Toad, Death Frog, not the other one. And this is Psychroid or something very similar to that. Next in, we gotta be getting close. I think we're less than 10. So we're definitely more than three fourths of the way done. Dragon Mirror, Earth Spear Lady, uh, Train Roid. Poison Draw Frog, and you got a Cyber Hound. I hope it's called that. I should look this one up. If it's not called Cyber Hound, someone in Korea was doing a disservice. Or not Korea, they didn't name it. Japan was doing a disservice. Plain Roid thing. Water Spear Lady. Singing Frogs. Poison Draw Frog. And Freezer Crab on the end. Sick. Next pack, next pack. I think we're still due maybe another Super. I don't think we've got many... I think that was actually our only super rare from the box so far. Arrival appears. Death Frog, Frieza Crab, Drillroid, and on the end, there we go. Speak of the Devil, just a regular Cyber Dragon as a super rare. We got one of each of the boys, so you really can't go wrong there. What else would you want from a Cybernetic Revolution booster box than to get all of the variations of a Cyber Dragon? Obviously, if an ultimate rare still looms out there, I want the ultimate rare cybernetic dragon. It would look beautiful next to my blue eyes in Korean. Pot of Generosity, Fire Stick, Plain Roid, Angel Tyrell is who I'm thinking from Seven Deadly Sins, Tyrell, something like that. Elemental Hero Bubble Man to go with our ultra rare. We already have one, but we'll take it for sure. Ultimate rare. Sorry, I forgot that one's badass. I, th I really do think it is ultimate rare uh, because the stars are also like textured on it. Okay, deaths, not dust frogs, just regular frogs. Goblins sleeping and they were disturbed. Uh, boss man as a robot, poison draw frog. And you got this friggin' warlock just sending out some beams all over the place as our rare. It's official, y'all. We have five packs remaining in our wonderful booster box of cybernetic revolution. Let's hope we get a few more bangers to go out on. Just something fun. This box was sick to us. We definitely are not uh, hit list, if that makes sense. We're not in dire need of them. Arrival appears. But I think we should get one. Tight two. And we got Trainroid on the end. That's not his name, but it's some kind of roid. 
All right, next pack, keeping it rolling. Fourth pack, fourth to last pack. I think it's so absurd that these boxes are only like 20 bucks too. Because even though the values I'm gonna pop up on screen are in English, some of these Korean cards still fetch a fair pretty penny out there on the market. Taitsu, I think. It's Taitsu or Sotsu or something. It was actually Doitsu. So that was the name. I was totally off on the first letter, but I was close with the rest. Water Spear Lady. Tyranno Infinite. Cyroid, I think. Cyber Puppy. Ooh, a super rare octopus robot in space shooting a laser. That thing is actually pretty sick looking. Shooting a sweet laser and there's a rocket headed right towards it. This thing is sick. A cool little super rare to, I guess, go out on. I don't know if there'll be hits in there, too. I don't know how much longer the little wall of hits is going to hold there. They're far past the booster box at this point. Here we go. Froggy singing. Water Spear Lady. Drillroid the Boy. Hurt Man. And you got just a regular rare dragon with an energy ball. The final pack to end off our Korean Cybernetic Revolution booster box is this one in my hands. I now have it out of the packaging. Let's see, can we get a banger to go out on? This box has definitely been good to us. A rival appears. Samurai with the box on her back. Tyranno Infinite. Again, if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like. I am so down to do more Korean Yu-Gi-Oh! booster boxes. Leave a comment and let me know what set you might want me to do. And then let's check out our very final card of the opening. It is, whoa, what the fuck? We got an ultimate rare cyber dragon. Dude, what the hell? This thing is sick. Oh my goodness, how the hell? Dude, we got two ultimate rares in one box? Dude, and I was counting out this pack too. This thing is sick. Damn, man, this thing is gonna look sick next to blue eyes when I put them on display. Holy shit, dude. How are we about to get, I don't care about the other ones right this second. How we get two ultimate rares in one booster box. This was sick. You got everything you wanted. I don't ever have to revisit Cybernetic Revolution when you got all the bangers in one box. Here's just one final look at that banger of an ultimate rare we just pulled. This thing is sick. Cyber Dragon. I think this one's just Cyber Dragon. Uh, the corners look a little bit messed up on my boy. And the centering looks a little off. But it is still a sick card nonetheless. All right, y'all, here is a final recap of our hits from that box. This one was from the special pack that we got. This is the hits from the Cybernetic Revolution box. We got three super rares, Cyber Dragon, Cyber Twin Dragon. We got Cyber End Dragon as an ultra rare, which was sick in its own right. I was okay right there. And then we got Ultimate Rare, Cyber Dragon. And then we also got Elemental Bubble Man, Elemental Hero Bubble Man, Ultimate Rare. Two ultimate rares in one box is absolutely more than I could ask for. I still think it's absurd. I got all that for this $20 box of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. That is sick. Again, if you guys did enjoy the video, definitely drop a like, leave a comment, let me know if you want me to open more Korean Yu-Gi-Oh and what set I should buy. I will also open modern Yu-Gi-Oh here and there. But yeah, guys, thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one. See you later. Holy shit, guys. As I was cleaning up and I was cleaning up all the empty packaging, I found one actual last pack that was just hanging out on the ground over there. So we're gonna open this up. I was so surprised. I was like, what the fuck? So let's get into it and see if we get anything else to end off this box even harder than we just did. Poison Draw Frog, Train Roid Type Beat, Goblin Dragon, and on the end, what the hell? We got a goddamn super rare to end it off. Goblin Elite Attack Force as a super rare. It's just their armor that's reflective. That is so sick. Dude, how do we get another goddamn super rare in this box? Yeah, I just wanted to throw this last pack in there because obviously uh, I found it and I want it in the video. So there you go, guys. Another banger on the end there.